Alright, so this time we're going to make a door that requires a key to open it. Let's get started. Start off in your character blueprint, add new variable. I'm going to name this door key. Compile, save, close that. Make a new blueprint class actor for your door. I added a static mesh in a box collision that's bigger than the, the static mesh in here. And then you go into the event graph. And on begin play, we're going to get player character. And then we're going to cast to your BP third person character. Right click the pin and promote to variable. And then we're going to make a custom event. To open the door. Drag from here and do a timeline. You can name it whatever you want, it doesn't really matter. Open that up. I'm going to change the length here to 2 seconds. Add a vector track. And then you want to right click and add a key to all values. And set these first ones to alt to 0, 0. <laughs> and then on the second side here, you add another one. And these are going to be for time of 2. And the first two are going to be 0 for X and Y. And then Z I'm going to put up to 300. Compile, save that. Go back to your event graph. We're going to get our static mesh out. And get the actor location. Split the pin. Drag from the static mesh and set relative location. Split the location. Plug it in update. Plug the bottom track of Z into from the timeline. And then do X and Y from your other, from the static mesh. Then get your box and scroll down and get on component begin overlap with an equals for your character into a branch. After that, drag from your character and you want to get that door key. And then you want to see if it's equal to true into another branch. And if it is, you want to drag from there and do a do once. Drag from there and open your door. And then you can add a sound here if you want. And then you can get your actor location for the location. And that should be it for in the door. I'm just going to move this up and then compile, save, close that. Next we're going to make the key actor. So make a new blueprint class actor key. I set this up as just a bunch of cubes lined up to resemble a key. And then you got a box collision that's bigger than it. Go over to the event graph, on begin play, get player character, cast to BP third person character, right click promote to variable, then you want to grab your character, and you do a custom event, for pick up the key, <coughs> set that door key variable from your character, and plug that in. Then you want to get the actor location and play sound at location if you want to sound. Same way as the other one. And then from there you can drag and destroy the actor. Next you want to do the on component begin overlap. See if it's equal to your player character. Into a branch. And then you want to get your pickup key event off of true. Compile, save, and that should be it for here. Close that. Now I'm going to set a key on this little table that I made here. It's pretty big, so I'm just going to scale it down. And then I'll add the door into this blank spot here. Rotate that in place. And then we can save it and test it out. Notice the door won't open when you walk up to it. But when you go pick up the key, and you walk up to the door, it will open for you. Thanks for watching.